Now, if you look at the diagram, you'll notice we've added another slanted line or oblique line. And this one is above the baseline. The slanted line above the baseline is only used when you have a linking verb. And our major linking verb is uh, the verb to be. And it could be any form of it, whether it's be, being, been, is, am, are, was, and were. And what happens is it's linking the subject to what we call a subject complement. Subject complement can be either a noun or an adjective. Let's consider a sentence. The green aliens are, there's our beaver, Martians. So we know we have a linking verb. And Martians then becomes a what we call a subject complement. It could be either a noun or a verb. In this case, it's a noun. And we'll call it the predicate nominative. Let's code it very quickly. We have our verb, which we know is R. And since it's one of the B verbs, I assume it's going to be a linking verb. We ask ourselves who or what are. Well, that tells us who our subject is, and our subject are aliens. Is the word aliens. So aliens, I guess we're not really going to call them people at this point. Get to know them better. So we'll call them things. The aliens are. Okay, we have green, which is modifying of the noun aliens. So we know that's an adjective. And Martians is another noun. really another name for aliens, which is how this works. So, we start on the left-hand side of the line that dissects the baseline, and we put our subject there, aliens. We have our verb, which is a linking verb, B. And now we have what we call predicate well, the subject complement, which in this case is a predicate nominative, Martians. Okay, let's get our modifiers in quickly. The article modifier the, and we have green aliens. Now, just to be clear, this we're going to call it's a subject complement. And it's signified by this arrow. It's really sailing, it's referring back to the noun aliens are Martians. We really could turn this around, couldn't we, and say Martians are aliens. Linking them, saying the same sort of thing. And since in this case Martians is a noun, we call it a predicate. Nominative. Now, we can also have in the same place a Predicate adjective. Either way, they are, it's a subject complement, 
So let's change this Martians to something which is modifying aliens. So let's say let's say it's aliens are silly. Now we now silly is an adjective modifying aliens. And it is what we call a predicate adjective, but still a subject compound. Really important thing to note here, though, is that R is a linking verb. And it's our major one, it's the B verb. Um, we, have, we can have others. Um, we have major linking verb is to be. And that can be to be in all of its forms. It can be to be is was were am be being been. But we can have other linking verbs besides to be. We can have become. Sometimes seems now if we were to straighten this line out let's see the green aliens Eat would be an action verb. Eat would eat. eat paper. We have our main verb, which now is an action verb. Eat. And our subject remains the same. Subject is aliens. So we don't know them very well, so let's say things and they eat things paper and so our adjective we represent with an ADJ. So we have aliens The action verb to eat. Now, what do aliens eat? They eat paper. Now, since we have an action verb here, it is an action verb. It is followed by what we call the direct object. Paper is the direct object of the action verb eat. It receives the action of the verb eat. In this case, we'll draw the arrow that way. And we end up with a direct object. Let's finish our diagram here. We have the article modifier the, and again it's a green alien, the green aliens. So the main thing for you to remember is if we've got an action verb, you can say, for instance, whatever it is, if it's the verb is eat, it eats what? It eats paper. On the other hand, if you have a linking verb, then you're going to have what we call a subject complements. It will follow the linking verb and it'll be uh, it will have it'll also be following a slanted line, and we would end up with a predicate. 
nominative if it's not a noun. Or a predicate adjective is an adjective. So these two will follow a linking verb. and be denoted by a slanting line. The direct object will follow an action verb and it will have a straight vertical 